Good morning from San Francisco. I'm Rocky Theus. Happy to be back with my Good Day family. We are here on Arguello Street in the city at Covet. It is a boutique here and it's got everything you need from clothing to jewelry to local San Francisco goods, et cetera, et cetera. And here to tell you more is Adrian, the owner of this cute boutique. Now tell us first and foremost, for people who don't know, what does Covet mean? What is your mission here? Covet actually means to sort of hold something dear and really treasure it. And that's the way I feel about everything in the store. Like I actually curate everything and make sure that we're bringing customers like really neat little treasures. I love that. And I've, as I look around, there's stuff from all over the place. You've got right behind you, Scott, we've got some stuff handmade here in the city and then you have things from Atlanta, from the East Coast, like everywhere, right? Exactly. Yeah, I curate things from my travels. Like we bring in cool brands from Tokyo or Montreal, as well as right here in the Bay. I love that. Okay, now we are also looking here, which is the grand finale, is your new jewelry bar. Tell us your inspiration behind this and why you brought it into your yeah, store. Yeah, so I'm really excited about the jewelry bar. I actually came up with the idea when I was on vacation in Tokyo over the holidays, and there were all these little boutiques devoted just to making jewelry. So I just thought it would be a great thing to add to the store, kind of a way for people to customize pieces and do something fun here in the store. I love that. And as you can see on that side here and on this side, both sides are handmade jewelry by you yourself. And now I'm going to make myself a handmade necklace, right? So tell, I'm going to give you the, I'm going to give you the mic and okay. tell me how I'm supposed to make myself some jewelry here. Okay. So what's the process? Great. So first, what you're going to do is I like to balance a piece. So why don't you pick a charm out first? Um, this one, I got my eye on this guy right here. Great, yeah, so that's a semi-precious stone. That one's Smoky Mountain Turquoise. So we'll start with that, and then, yeah, like the, the arrow, arrow, that's really cute. And then initials are always super popular. Oh, yes, okay, got an R. Yay! Got an R right there, meant to be, meant to be. Okay, these are my three charms, right? Perfect. There. Those are my three charms. Okay, so now, what do I do next? Because this okay. seems like the hard part. Yeah, <laughs> this is the hard part. So I take it from here. Okay. So we start out with our three charms, and then you can pick a chain. Um, I like long chains. Okay. So this one here. So let's do that one. So that's a gold fill chain. So we start with that. And then what we're going to do is I add what's called jump rings to kind okay. of attach everything. And this is something that people can do at home as well, right? Yeah, people can totally do it at home. We're actually developing little home kits for jewelry, which oh, okay. we've had requests for. So those will be probably happening a little bit closer to the holidays. I love that. And of course, this all started for you through a hobby yourself. So it is. Exactly. if you guys are inspired, get into it. <laughs> we are at Covet on Arguella Street in San Francisco. Ooh, this is looking good already. I'm going to put this on as soon as I'm done. All right, check it out, you guys. And it's covetsf.com, right? Covetsf.com. All right, check them out, you guys. I'll send it back cool. to you. Yeah, and if you can't get there, you know, I know San Francisco may be far for some of our viewers. They do have.